I'd like to work on a little bit of pick technique with you today. When you hold the pick, make sure it rests on the side of your index finger. Uh, avoid letting it get on, on this under side, this pad of your finger. That's not going to work. It's got to be on the side. Also, don't let it sneak up into the second bone. That's not going to work. It's got to be on this first bone on the side. Then you add your thumb. Usually we choke up a little bit, so just a small part of the pick is exposed. These fingers should never touch the pick. Um, the technique for putting your hand on your guitar is very simple. You just kind of let it drop on the bridge. All guitars have a bridge. This, Even though they look a little different, they function the same. That's a perfect place to rest the side of your hand. It's like a martial arts knife edge strike there and just roll right along this edge. Very easy. Just drop it. That's going to solve a lot of technical problems. Um, if you didn't do that, you'd be kind of using your arm to find the string, you're going to miss a lot. You're going to get frustrated. This is going to save you a lot of trouble. You just martial arts. Roll forward. Very, very simple. Yet there's a lot of confusion about that. This allows you to do a very small movement to play the string. You can easily get first string, second string, third, fourth, fifth and sixth with just a small adjustment of your wrist. It's okay to do some downstrokes on some rock and roll stuff. Sounds a certain way versus... So just use your ears and your common sense when when to do, use downstrokes. Say like Johnny Be Good. a lot of downstrokes. Then you start doing some alternating picking. That's down up down up. That's your basic picking setup. Here's something I like to do is, is I'll throw the pick in here quickly, hopefully. I've got three fingers to do some finger picking. Uh, 